what it's like to be an astronaut. And this is what it's like to be an astronaut. And this, and this. Why in the world would you want to attend space camp? After all, you'll be thrown, tumbled, tossed, and launched. You'll have fun, and at the same time, you'll even learn a thing or two. Fact is, most graduates discover their space camp studies so exciting, they enroll in more math and science courses when they return to school. So why in the world would you want to attend space camp? Because space camp is about a million light years from anything you've ever done. 104 into the flight computer. Your voyage to the stars could begin right here. Although Space Camp Alabama and Space Camp Florida are similar in their programs, each also has its own unique experiences. If you attend Space Camp in Huntsville, you'll visit the world's largest space museum, the U.S. Space and Rocket Center. The history of man's conquest of space unfolds in the sights, sounds, and hands-on exhibits. and sounds will surround you in the Space Dome Theater. Moving pictures taken by shuttle astronauts are projected on a screen that soars more than six stories high. In Huntsville, you'll tour the birthplace of America's space program, NASA's Marshall Space Flight Center. This is where Dr. Werner Von Braun and his team created the powerful rockets that launched man to the moon. You'll take a motion-based trip through the universe on an exciting journey to Jupiter and get a feel for what it might be like to explore another planet as you perform experiments on the surface of Mars. Space Camp Florida is located at the entrance to the Kennedy Space Center and is adjacent to the Astronaut Hall of Fame. Founded by the original Mercury 7 astronauts, the Hall of Fame pays tribute to America's space pioneers through the astronauts' own words and memorabilia. Space Camp Florida features the Shuttle to Tomorrow, a stimulating simulator that will heighten your senses as it blasts you into the future. Become a mission specialist as you take a spacewalk up and down the zero-g wall. See how you fare as a shuttle commander on final approach in the shuttle landing simulator. In Florida, you visit the very site where NASA opens the door to space, the Kennedy Space Center. And if your timing is right, who knows? You might just see the real thing. Whether you choose to attend Space Camp in Huntsville, Alabama, or Titusville, Florida, you'll be under the guidance of highly trained counselors from the moment you arrive. At registration, you'll meet your teammates and the counselor who will be in charge of your mission training. Like all astronauts in training, you'll be assigned your own bunk. But don't think you'll be spending a lot of time in it. There's work to be done. You and your team will design and construct a satellite in a clean room environment. You'll participate in water activities, simulating crew egress, water survival, or microgravity. You'll sample space foods. You'll learn the basics of propulsion and aeronautics by building and then launching your own rocket. You'll learn what it's like to walk on the moon. Experience the thrill of flying untethered in outer space using an MMU. That's short for manned maneuvering unit. Discover the sensation of working in a microgravity environment in the five degrees of freedom chair. Experience the G-forces as if a rocket were blasting you into space. I wouldn't want my mom to know this, but they actually made it kind of fun to learn stuff. Look up there, guys. This is 183 feet tall. Like when they're telling us about rockets. We were right there next to the one they were talking about. Here at Space Camp, you'll train like a real astronaut. Then put that training to the test when you and your team pull together to see if you can get the shuttle Columbia into orbit and back again. Here's where that team building and problem solving practice pays off big time. I was the mission specialist, so it was my job to perform the EVA. EVA, that's extravehicular activity in space talk. With the EVA behind us, the commander and pilot bring us in. But after five days of space camp, it's going to be hard to come back to Earth. To reserve your week at U.S. Space Camp, 
Call 1-800-63-SPACE today. A couple of days ago, I never even met this person. And now here we are, depending on each other to get this mission accomplished. No time to waste. You'll have two shuttle missions this week, so training will begin almost immediately upon your arrival. That very first afternoon, you'll be receiving your shuttle operations briefing and a mission overview. You'll head to the computer lab for an introduction to the lunar base you'll be constructing. You'll get your first glimpse of the astronaut training equipment that you will be training on. You'll hit the sack that very first night with a mind full of new ideas. Already you can see why nearly half of Space Academy graduates claim that their experiences here helped them in choosing a college major. And this is just the beginning. Each day is non-stop. You'll visit the world's largest space museum, the U.S. Space and Rocket Center. The history of man's conquest of space unfolds in the sights, sounds, and hands-on exhibits. You'll visit NASA's Marshall Space Flight Center the very site where Werner Von Braun's team tested the rockets that took America to the moon. You'll visit the Aviation Challenge Lake for your water survival training. Aviation Challenge is a unique program designed to give trainees a sample of the training experienced by military pilots in preparation for space flight. And you'll take an exciting motion-based journey to Jupiter. Space Academy has formed a unique relationship with the University of North Dakota that allows trainees the option of performing experiments while in actual flight. As a Space Academy trainee, you will see, you will hear, you will feel, you will even taste what it's like to be an astronaut. And you'll be challenged during two different shuttle missions. T minus 15 seconds to count. The different missions will give you the opportunity to experience mission control orbiter, and extravehicular activities, or EVAs as we call them in space. You'll even dock with a space station and perform experiments before returning to Earth. Graduates unanimously agree the realism, the drama, the daring of the simulator shuttle missions are out of this world. Yeah, it's like fun. A new kind of fun. My friends are going to think I'm really making it all up when I tell them about it. I'll just have to tell them to come see it for themselves. To book your five-day experience at Space Academy Level 1, call 1-800-63-SPACE today. We got problems. Space Station, this is Enterprise. Suit up, we're coming around to get you. Did you hear that? Let's get our space suit. Mission Control, this is Enterprise, preparing for OMS burn, rendezvous with the space station. Delay that, Enterprise. What? If we don't do something quick, they won't make it. I'm going in. Enterprise, this is Mission Control. Do not repeat, do not attempt rendezvous. Do you copy? We've got to do something. We can't just leave them there. Enterprise doesn't have the fuel for a maneuver like that. Mission Control, Enterprise, get us out of here. Prepare to be challenged as you've never been challenged before. Space Academy Level 2 is divided into three tracks of study. Each track is designed to give you a taste of the opportunities and demands of careers you might be considering. Engineering track and technology track trainees will practice experiments in the simulated microgravity of the UAT, the Underwater Astronaut Trainer. As an engineering trainee, you'll go on to conduct extravehicular activities, EVAs as we call them in the space program during shuttle missions. Or perhaps you'll be in mission control as propulsions officer or communications officer. Your specialized studies in such fields as robotics, engineering systems, payloads and structures, and optics will make you eminently qualified for your position. On tours of NASA's Marshall Space Flight Center, you'll discover firsthand the opportunities available in the aerospace field. Getting a shuttle into space is no easy task for the orbiter crew or for mission control. Yet that effort is worth it if it expands our knowledge of the universe. As a technology track trainee, you'll conduct the experiments that broaden our knowledge. Your studies in space science, micro-G science, space physiology, and DNA technology qualify you for this prestigious role. 
As an aerospace track trainee, you'll be expected to fly and land the shuttle safely. Therefore, your training will prepare you for just that. You will study aerodynamics and aeronautics along with rocketry, space piloting, and celestial navigation. You'll practice what you've learned in jet fighter simulators at Aviation Challenge. And should you choose the you can fly option, you'll practice in a real airplane. Okay, let's go. Space Academy has formed a unique relationship with the University of North Dakota that allows level two aerospace trainees the option of spending actual flight time at the controls of an airplane. Go ahead and add takeoff flaps. Pull the lever back until you see the takeoff. All level two trainees who successfully complete the program will earn one college credit hour of freshman level science. The climax of eight days at Space Academy, however, is not graduation. The climax is your EDM, your extended duration mission. This 12-hour mission puts you and your team to the test, where everything you've learned, all of your practice, comes together. Will you be able to overcome the anomalies, the problems as they arise? Will you have the right stuff? We got it, look, right here. I think they've got it. Space Station, this is Mission Control. The Tiger Team has your solution. Prepare to execute computer command sequence Charlie Delta 7. To book your eight-day experience at Space Academy Level 2, call 1-800-63-SPACE today. Just putting this thing on makes me feel transformed. I'll admit it. When I first saw the tower, I got a lump in my throat. But as I suited up, I focused on what the counselor had told me. And when the time came, I was in the zone, and there was nothing I couldn't do. Aviation Challenge offers a five-day basic program for grades seven through nine, and a five-day intermediate program for grades 10 through 12. Beginning this year, a ninth grader previously attending the basic program will be allowed to attend the intermediate program. America's original astronauts and all of today's shuttle pilots were military aviators. Aviation Challenge gives you a taste of what it's like to be a high-tech jet pilot. You and your squadron will learn to move and think as one. You'll learn to trust one another as you practice your escape from a downed aircraft. Intermediate trainees will learn the buddy system while rehearsing a swim for safety after a simulated parachute into uncharted waters. Fortunately, the rescue chopper is ready to lift these intermediates to safety. But what if the chopper is not so quick to the scene? You and your team will practice water survival. You'll practice land survival, how to find food and water, how to use the materials you have for shelter, safety, and possible evasion. Take a good deep grunt hold. Intermediate trainees will feel the real-life sensations of pulling three Gs while undergoing training in the centrifuge. Your studies will include the basics of aeronautics, aerodynamics, and meteorology. Then you'll take what you learn in the classroom directly to the skies, flying simulated air combat missions. Basic trainees will fly missions in jet training simulators, while intermediates will perform their missions at supersonic speeds. All trainees will fly in pilot-co-pilot teams, combining forces to rule the skies. Aviation Challenge has formed a unique partnership with the University of North Dakota that allows basic trainees the option of spending flight time performing experiments or intermediates actual time at the controls of an airplane. UND Aerospace flies from the Huntsville International Airport, and intermediate trainees will earn college credit from the University of North Dakota. I have them on radar, five miles out in closing. Tally ho, I have a visual. At the end She's of the week, basic and intermediate aviation challenge squadrons will put their teamwork and training to the test in the red flag competition. I have a lot. Yep, a realistic war game demanding teamwork and individual excellence. Got him, we have a kill. And at graduation, Everyone will know who's the real top gun. To reserve your week at Aviation Challenge, call 1-800-63-SPACE today. Oh, 
I mean, I had no idea. I thought I'd be standing around watching while he had all the fun. No, no, really, I guarantee you, most of the screaming and yelling you hear at Parent and Child Space Camp, it's coming from the parents. And while I was rediscovering what it's like to be a kid, he was discovering what it's like to take some real responsibility. Columbia, you are, you are go for throttle up. Roger, go and throttle up. Engines at 104%. Columbia, Houston, you are looking good. Stand by for booster separation. Roger, fly. Space Camp's parent and child program makes learning and fun inseparable and makes parents a part of the process. If you attend Parent Child Space Camp in Huntsville, you'll visit the world's largest space museum, the U.S. Space and Rocket Center. The history of man's conquest of space unfolds in the sights, sounds, and hands-on exhibits. The sights and sounds will surround you in the Space Dome Theater. Moving pictures taken by shuttle astronauts are projected on a screen that soars more than six stories high. You will tour the birthplace of America's space program, NASA's Marshall Space Flight Center. You'll experience the future of space travel for yourself as you take a motion-based trip into deep space during your journey to Jupiter. If you attend parent-child camp in Titusville, Florida, you'll visit the Astronaut Hall of Fame. Through the astronauts' own words, you'll relive their heroic missions. Florida also features the Shuttle to Tomorrow, a stimulating simulator that will heighten your senses as it launches you into the future. In Florida, you'll visit the very site where NASA does its own launching, the Kennedy Space Center. And if your timing is right, who knows? You might just see the real thing. Regardless of which location you choose, Parent-Child Space Camp is a true team effort. Together, parent and child teams will build and launch their own rocket. They'll experience astronaut training in simulators like the manned maneuvering unit, simulating untethered spaceflight. The Five Degrees of Freedom chair demonstrates the sensations of working in a microgravity environment. The One-Sixth Gravity chair may be as close as you ever come to walking on the moon. All systems working and Max-Q is on time. Two simulated shuttle missions give parent and child an opportunity to work as a team in mission control and as members of the orbiter crew. Everything we did, we did together. And when we got our wings at graduation, we were together. Every parent dreams of opening a child's eyes to the possibilities a good education can bring. Space Camp it's done that, and I think the knowledge, the enthusiasm, the friendship we developed here, it's going to be with us for a long time. To book your weekend at Parent and Child Space Camp, call 1-800-63-SPACE today. Everyone agrees, Space Camp Space Academy and Aviation Challenge are a lot of fun. And believe it or not, most everyone agrees they even enjoy their learning experiences. In fact, 93% of Space Camp grads are so excited by what they learn, they find themselves taking more science and math courses when they return to school. The majority of Space Campers go on to college, and nearly half claim their experiences help them in choosing a major. These programs will give you a unique opportunity to meet and talk with men and women who are currently working in science and engineering fields. Many say this helps them to choose a career. Now here is some important information to help you get the most from your Space Camp, Space Academy, or Aviation Challenge experience. If you fly, you will arrive in Huntsville, Alabama at the Huntsville International Airport. In Florida, you will arrive at the Orlando International Airport. From the moment you arrive, you'll be under the guidance of experienced counselors. At the airport, you'll board Space Camp Transportation for the trip to your final destination. If you're driving to Space Camp, directions will be sent upon request. Because every trainee is a VIP, you'll be provided with around-the-clock security. For the duration of your mission, you'll eat, sleep, work, and play within the Space Camp campus. 
A variety of accommodations make this home away from home for Space Camp, Space Academy, and Aviation Challenge trainees. In Alabama and Florida, nursing care is available 24 hours a day. Ask any astronaut and he or she will tell you that you don't go into space for the food. You'll get to sample some space foods that will make you appreciate the breakfast, lunch, and dinner served in the Space Camp cafeteria just that much more. Each program culminates with graduation ceremonies. Parents are invited and encouraged to attend. Guest speakers, team awards, and individual recognition as you receive your wings make graduation a special time. The excitement, challenges, and rewards of Space Camp, Space Academy, and Aviation Challenge are available to everyone. Several programs have been designed especially for the deaf or for the blind. And you don't have to be a kid to enjoy an out-of-this-world experience. Space Academy and Aviation Challenge offer adult programs. The Aviation Challenge Adult Program even offers an option of flying a real fighter plane in laser tag air-to-air -air combat, if you've got the right stuff. Space Academy for Educators gives teachers a chance to earn additional college credit while collecting materials and experiences they can use to inspire their classrooms. Why in the world would you want to attend Space Camp? because Space Camp is about a million light years from anything you've ever experienced. It's easy to book your adventure. Just call 1-800-63-SPACE today.